Hey, uh, something back there for you, pal. Once in a while, pal, you're gonna see a real fancy bozo try to ruin your good time. You'll know him because he's glowing like a light. But that's his special armor, see? You gotta punch right through it. He's gonna shrug you off until you do. For a good time, beware the fancy glowing bozos on my quest. Check. Another weapon. The courtyard of the House of Hades is kept neat and orderly, in contrast to the terrifying sprawl that lies beyond. It's not that orderly, really. My shield. Excellent. Hey, room. Um, Nix, you've done so much for me, I thought you might like this. You know your father does not like it when nectar is doled out on the premises, dear child. However, I am not he, and I wished regardless to provide you a token of my affection. I'm very grateful, Nix. Hey, Meg. I uh, thought I'd better hand this over. I'll confiscate that if you really want. Although I'm warning you, I'm not susceptible to bribes. Many have tried. Hey, I'm just handing over contraband to the appropriate authorities. Think nothing of it, Meg. Just doing our jobs, right? The lounging area within the House of Hades is a dismal place to be. In spite of its intended purpose to enliven the house's grim inhabitants. It's <gasps> oh, the prince himself. You want to talk to me? Me? Oh, wow. Oh, wow. I uh, just wanted to say the lounge looks wonderful. As good as new. Better. I hope it's not been too much trouble patching up. Thanks for all your hard work. Surprise, Hypnos. I got you this. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You can't bring that in here. Eh, just kidding. Thanks. But wait, I'll trade you. Look. Cheers, Hypnos. Hey, welcome. Achilles on break, I guess. Hey, uh, father, I thought maybe, you know, uh, here. Where did you get this? You think you can butter me up with such trifles? Give me that, and then get out of here. You're welcome, father. Time to go. I have to tell you something, little Hades. My relatives and I, we've been holding back one of our greatest gifts to see if you were worthy. And you are. My aid is yours. So call me if you need anything, especially to smash your enemies to bits. Oh, what's this? Wrath of Poseidon at my beck and call.
something. Uncle Poseidon blessed you, didn't he? To think that big fat oaf is your own father's brother. I'm told to be respectful near him, but it's hard. Hey, sir. Hey, quick question, Sisyphus. You seen the other Fury Sisters lately? I've not seen the other Fury Sisters in some time now that you mention it. Just Megara, the kindly one. And she is quite a handful on her own. I'll keep an eye out for the other two. Not to worry. A pleasure. Bye now. death dealer, my kin. For by my estimation, you have slain at least a thousand souls down there. Souls mostly having died before, but still.
means I need to look for better help. That's that. Stones. Shop. I can use this. Why, hello, Curse. I thought we are running into one another here. Among the wares of my professional associate, I mean. Must be some sort of clerical mistake. And here we go. Here, Meg. <laughs> You're not escaping death this time here, Zagreus. You ready to go home? No, not just yet, though thanks for asking, Meg. If you intend to force me, know that I'm going to resist with all my might. Well, I appreciate the warning. And now prepare to die. problem. Blood of the Titans. You're going nowhere, boy. Why not? Next floor. Cheers.
getting warmer. Poseidon got to you before I did is. I let him. He's under the impression he's as bright as ever. this goes. through. Oh, Zag, man, you look positively knackered. You be sure and take it easy if you can out there, all right? Yeah, maybe this will help. To my health. Who doesn't love this stuff? Charon's offerings ahead, I guess. I'll pay for that. The searing flame and ashes of the river Phlegathon mean nothing to the ferryman Charon, who travels all the waters of the underworld bearing the dead, the damned, and all their fineries. I do enjoy dead people's fineries. Care to provide me any insight as to just what sort of hideous monstrosity awaits me over on the next infernal island, Kiron mate? <sighs> that bad, huh? Kiron, you've been such a reassuring sight, I thought I'd offer you a token of my gratitude. Wait, you don't have to give me something in return. It was a gift. Though, you're insisting, aren't you? I don't know what to say, mate. Hello, 
vicious circle. with witches then, I guess. Oh, uh, hey there, Dusa. How's your endless toil treating you? Um, Mr. Hypnos, do you maybe think that you could, you know, uh, keep an eye on the procession line before Lord Hades, like you were supposed to? Oh, um, that's no problem. I can definitely do that. I'll just add it to the list. Good, then. Glad we had the chance to chat. Now, maybe get some sleep or something. You look pretty beat. Get on it, Hypnos. Achilles, sir. I got a relic of some sort out there. A globule of ancient blood which formed after I fought with Megara. Is this really the Titan's blood I found? As far as I know, yes, lad. That it is. Though who's exactly, I'm not so sure. You'd best hang on to it and keep it safe. Your weapons, they shall thirst for it and drink it up. Not yet, perhaps, but soon. Well, I wasn't about to drink it. <coughs> Guess what, boy? Made it all the way to Asphodel last time. I fully understand how come you never liked it there. Now to trek on back, I guess. Take care. Despite the Underworld Prince's optimism, his old companion Cerberus, the multi-headed hound, maintains a somewhat sulky attitude for now. Always have more pets for the greatest boy. Permit the dog his rest. You call my chambers a mess? Look at your desk, father. Whatever happened to your court musician, huh? Where's his sentencing parchment work? Stuck in Tartarus all because he stopped singing for you on command. My desk is far more organized than you, boy. And if you're so concerned about our court musician, why don't you commute a sentence yourself? Seeing as I haven't gotten around to it yet. Sure, happy to oblige. I'll just ask the house contractor since you're too busy. Contractor, mind locating the court musician's sentence when you get the chance? There we go. Here are the gems. Should make a nice enough addition to my chambers. What is that doing there? Maybe you'll have something more affordable next time. In the name of Hades, I commute our court musician sentencing effective now. Oh, um, hello. Ah, Orpheus. Oh, hello, Zagreus. I understand you liberated me from my eternal punishment. And so I have returned to serve your father here. Thanks. Orpheus, you're back. Look. Don't get on father's bad side like that and you're going to be fine. Besides, right now I think he's angry with me. I 
reprieve for you, my friend. But if you've come to ask me for a song, why? I'm afraid I must stand firm about my answer. It's all right. Father can't make you sing if you don't want to. Here. I trust that the mirror in your bedchamber has proved satisfactory, dear child. Better than I could have possibly imagined, Nix. You mentioned there was something more that it could do once I had grown accustomed. I think I'm ready for that now. I think you are as well. Then it shall be as you wish. Thank you. Meg must have gone back already. What's new? I want to go lie down. I'll just set that there. A beautifully decorated, subtly enchanted bowl containing traces of the hapless prince's past attempts to flee the underworld now accents a particularly cluttered corner of his room. Always wanted my own scrying pool. As many chances as it takes. What do you know? This came true. Tartarus is gloomy enough without Orpheus in it. The mirror's grown in power. Thank you, Nyx. Excellent. <laughs> 